Hi guys, welcome to a special video. This is Man Hanif on behalf of Ecom Hustlers. Um, in this video, um, I just want to show you the main apps that I use for my Shopify stores. Okay, so um, basically, you don't have to complicate this process. Um, all you do is when you have your store, you need to make sure you have the essential apps. Okay, the essential apps where you are going to save yourself a lot of time and you're also going to give a good impression of your store to people okay so as you can see I'm on the app uh, Shopify app store right now <clears throat> and the first app which uh, I'm, I'm just gonna get straight into this video without boring you so the first app that I recommend you um, download or install on your store is this one here um, easy contact form now what this app does is it basically allows your potential customers to contact you and so as you can see from the screenshots here, your peop your customers can um, click on a button that says contact us on your store and they can, you know, um, if they've got any queries, they can, you, you, they can, you can guide them to your email address, forward it. Um, the reason I'm stressing this is on some Shopify stores, I've not even seen people have this contact form. So how the hell are people meant to contact you if you don't have um, this feature? Now you have to understand is when people have an inquiry, um, they not they, they they don't have to you know browse your site on the contact button just to find an email address. They have you have to give um, you have to make the the experience user friendly as possible. Okay, so if I go on the site and I want to buy something, then I go on the contact us button. I want to make sure that that um, store that business I'm purchasing from, you know, they have some sort of feature where I can get in touch with them if there's any problems okay so that's one of the important things that you need to understand so easy contact form is <clears throat> a required app you probably might have something similar on your store which is fine I prefer to use this and it seems to be working okay um, the other app I recommend you have is some feature that allows people to track their order and if you type in tracking on the app store there's actually a lot of different tracking um, apps that you can install. I usually go for the free one. Um, so I usually go for this one, which basically allows my customers to track their um, product to see where it's reached. Because most, obviously, most of your products are from China. So that means um, after a few days, you're going to be given a tracking number by your supplier. You have to make sure that your customer is informed of the status of their, their their product so what you can do is have this tracking number have this tracking feature on your site so they don't leave your site they just enter the tracking number and away they go here's a screenshot again and how it looks like and it's very easy to use as you can see <coughs> it supports 360 plus carriers worldwide so if you're selling to the U U UK Europe Canada Asia anywhere really it's 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 great. I mean as you can see the reviews reviews speak for themselves, okay? So that's one app that I highly recommend. The other app is when people place an order, you have to give them some sort of receipt, okay, some sort of uh, reminder. And in this case, <coughs> sorry, I've got a bad cold. In this case, you have to um give again a positive user experience so in this case receiptful is a great app to have on your store and all this does is basically sends um, email receipts to your customers so when they place an order they automatically get these email receipts again this is free so you're not going to pay anything for this and uh, what I like about this app is also the upsells so you can have upsells and product recommendations <clears throat> on the receipt itself. So if someone buys um, a keychain off your store and at the bottom when they're paid, they get this receipt in the email, then also they'll get something like, also check out this, also check out this product, okay? So again, this is this is an amazing tool. Highly recommend this. So let's have a look at the screenshot. Here's an example of how it looks like. So basically you'll have your logo at the top your customers will have a coupon code that they can have which saves them 10 percent of the next purchase okay and also as you can see this is the price 
and it's very simple and easy to use okay um, the stats are very good um, here's a screenshot of the the, the app all it does is it shows you the insights, how many orders were placed, um, how much, um, how many people purchased your other products using this receiptful app, and it's very very good uh, to track all your orders. Okay, so it's it's a great app to have, and again I've got to stress it's free. Download it onto your store, um, use it effectively. Okay, so most people now like to offer free shipping for the items. Um, but that means have some sort of reminder on your store that there's free shipping of any orders over ten dollars or any orders of twenty dollars. <clears throat> so in this case, I use this app called Free Shipping Bar by Hexton. Again, it does it does work. It, it works really well. Here's someone who per, who who bought this um, who, who installed this on their store. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go on to. Um, Gonna check it out. Okay, let's have a look. This is how it looks like in a nutshell. <coughs> so here we have it. It says free shipping for orders over thirty pounds. So they've get the, you. You'll have your own toolbar. You can customize it, this toolbar. It appears at the top. Okay. So this is the store that someone set up. Um, on Shopify as you can see and um, this is a clothing store so if you just browse this again it's a very simple simple store some people like to use a simple you know theme in this case a white background very simple theme and it seems to be doing the job okay so this is actually a family run business so again you can see the potential of businesses who are using Shopify um, Let's just go back to the app. Okay, the other app I want to show you is um, one of the great app to use, and in fact, this is my favorite app of the lot. And if it wasn't for this, you know, I wouldn't be bothering with drop shipping. Okay, and in fact, this one is called Orbello, and you're probably using this. If you're not, you're pretty crazy not to get this. All it does is, with the click of a button. If you go to AliExpress and any products that you want to add on your site, you can just add these products onto your site, import them from AliExpress, and you can allow you you can give people their tracking number as well uh, very easily. Instead of going to AliExpress, finding the tracking number with a click of a button, you can just key in the order number, and this integrates with your store. Um, very very good app, as you can see, it's been in the news. Um, and uh, the reviews speak for themselves and again you know this is this app pays my bills very good app i love this app so you need to download this app as it here's some screenshots of the app itself as you can see so basically when you like a product from aliexpress you simply um, download a chrome plugin or bello it's got a plugin as well as well as the app um, chrome extension you download that and you simply um, add these products onto your store with a click of a button. Okay, so in this case, for example, if this is the product that we've just added, this will allow you to import images, add text files, add sorry, add add titles or change some prices around. Again, it's it's just so simple. Um, you'll know what I mean when 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 it comes to downloading it. Okay, so these are the main apps that I like to use. Um, finally, just want to talk to you about upsell apps. Um, Upsell apps are very good as well. Um, the one app that I've been using is this one, Upsell on Exit and Visit. It's a free app again. So um, what happens is when a person tries to leave your site, um, they get a pop-up, okay? They get a pop-up like this. Okay, we want to give you 10% discount for your first order, and then they return to the store, okay? So especially if you've got a lot of abandonment carts, you know, you need this app, okay? Uh, which reminds me also is use this app abandonment abandonment protector which is this one here and and what this does is it retrieves your lost sales so if someone buys your product tries to buy your product and then they come back later on they get they get a reminder after a few hours that you forgot to buy product this is a great great app 
it's made me a lot of sales in the past and it still does because you know what people do is sometimes they're about to buy something and then they get a reminder in the email and then they finish the order so this is this is a great app to have okay thanks for watching this video and i hope you utilize these apps onto your store my name is Manny Hanif and I'll see you on the other side peace